everyone, welcome to Kip TV. I am Kip, and today we have a match for you on Gravel Pit. It is from the Wireplay League, which is a league over in Europe. Actually, I don't know if there's some North Americans in it. I don't know. Maybe I should check that stuff before I start recording. Anyway, we have two teams for you today. Blue is E Colony, and red is Sandwiches and Friends, two top European Highlander teams. Uh, let's learn their names, shall we? Over on Blue, which is E Colony. Uh, is Beef Q as Heavy, Mente as Medic, Saba Saba is Spy, Letku is Soldier, Zub is Scout, Kisakala is Sniper, Noretis is Ng, Jonas is Pyro, and Napper is Demo. Over on Red we have Sandwiches and Friends, we have Devi is Medic, Wenzi is Soldier, Cubal is Scout, Hupe is Heavy, Prophet is Spy, Funk is Sniper, Bessie is Pyro, Illy he 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 is Engineer, and Disco 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 is Demo. Alright, we'll go ahead and get started. Hopefully you can't hear me just making a mess on my desk, but uh, that is what happened. We're going to look at the... Uh, trying to get the NG cam to watch what kind of build he's getting. Um, that is he he he. I'm gonna call him he. Illy he he. I'm gonna call him Red NG. How about that? Oh, what a what a dramatic suicide right there from Wenzi. Uh, that's what you love to see. Uh, interesting setup right here coming from Illy. I'm, no, I'm gonna go with Illy he he he. So, so Illy for short, that's going to be Red Engineer with an awesome hat, by the way. Um, he's building very open and um, not necessarily a space you would you m see most engineers build on, build on this B for, for gravel pit. Usually it'll be right here in the shadow to discourage jumpers from coming in with the heavy and medic, and usually the dispense will be back there for your teams. But we'll see what happens because he does have it at level 3 and the teleporter is up. So what we're going to see most likely is Blue suiciding some players in the jumping classes most likely, Demo, Soldier, uh, suiciding them in to B to force a red to pop, and here we do, we have the Demo up on the roof, fortunately the Soldier is there on the roof, but Napper uh, actually doing a lot of damage to Illy right there, and let him finish his off, so Engineer down, and that's simply going to smoke him, so all they have to do is just call that out to their team, and yeah, it just took a second of the Sapper from Saba Saba, and that center gun is down, so that placement probably not the best. Um, but it uh, looks like Illy knows that. St the teleporter is still up though, so he will be able to get back to these to point B. Uh, will he be able to get a center gun up as the question of? He's just now rebuilding it. A is capped relatively quickly, 43 seconds. Probably, I'm not actually sure how fast that can, top can uh, be capped, so I won't lie to you. But, um, so that's a really good time. And, um, was to won't defend A because it is a lot harder to defend. And, uh, B is so much easier and more fun to defend. What we see now from Red, that is Sandwiches and Friends, is a, a very standard defense. You want that soldier on the roof to deny jumpers. Again, sometimes you want that demo up there. Here we see the Uber coming in from Blue. It is met by an Uber from Red. We'll see if they can, uh, keep it off. And, oh, did you see that reflect? Did you see that reflect from Bessie? A three kill kill <laughs> reflect. Absolutely crazy. Um, doing a great job finishing off Mente right there. And Red is going to get some life from that. Sandwiches and Friends getting... Um, and I don't know if that's... We'll just say that was pure skill right there. Uh, even Napper has to smile and chat because that was really amazing. Uh, you practice those stuff, but uh, having won an official map is, a match is really exciting. <laughs> That's a nice reflect indeed from Bessie. Alright, so Red does have that extra minute to catch its breath and rebuild. So Illy really likes that, although he's gonna have to contend right now with the soldier on the roof. Uh, where is Red Soldier? Because he really needs to be up there defending right now. But he is, uh, Wenzi is nowhere to be found actually. Is he getting up there now? Yes, now Wenzi is finishing off Letku, but Letku. Um, actually did not do too much damage, just scared Illy right there for a period of time. He, uh, will be able to keep everything up though, so we have a level 3 as well. Uh, let's see, Menti is at about 80%, so let's go to Blue's Camp, because they will be pushing in very shortly. We'll be probably taking in Napper, because they know that level 3 sentry gun is there, and, uh, that is priority 1 right now. So we have 100% Uber, and we'll see, it is, does get popped, um, Heavy takes a lot of damage right there. Actually, no, Hoop was overhealed and uh, did not get that kill from Napper. Napper is just now spamming the center gun down, but he's going to have to deal with Wenzi right here, and he's going to... Ooh, yeah, it's going to fall, fall off. 
Uh, let's follow Bessie, see if uh, he slash she can to get another 3k, but actually Blue has stopped the push right now, so it does not look like that will happen. Uh, Leku is on the roof, but he goes down. Wenzie is doing his duty as soldier on the roof. Ooh, just on my nice sentry jump right there from Illy. So I can have that teleporter on top of the roof, which will give access to all the non-jumping classes, which will put up a nice roof defense, which again, is good for protecting the medic. And then the ninja stuff as well. So we'll see how Colony decides to play this, because it's, um, that first push did not go over so well. They took down the center gun very easily and capped A very fast, so it looked like there was going to be a fast cap for B. However, that has not been the case. And Red is on the High Lord. Hey, Zub is just coming in here doing it by himself. He does take down Funk, but uh, goes down himself. Uh, just, just scouting it out, seeing uh, if there's any chance that they might let him take the point for just for funsies. Uh, turns out sandwiches and friends are only friends with those of them, the, those who bear sandwiches, and uh, Zuba's not. I love this idea though of a level 3 ranked sentry gun in the tunnel right there to just harass and annoy. It uh, did go down, but it uh, did harass and annoy for a little bit of time at least. Prophet is down, so no spy to worry about as Blue comes in with this push coming from the right corner this time. Gonna get the sentry gun. No, actually, oh yes, they did. Uh, Illy picked up the sentry gun, but they got it anyway. Blue's Uber has moved to the point, leaving Napper all alone. He could not be saved right there. Red Medic has already gone down. There's only three up for Sandwiches and Friends. Gonna fall into... Oh, wow. 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 Zub coming in and finishing off Goop right there. And then hooking up with his Medic. They need to get on the point and get some heavier classes to help them secure B right now. But this looks like it will probably be the, be the cap for Colony. They just need to get somebody up here and it looks like that's exactly what Napper is doing. He is up here and just um, securing the entrances from C. And let's see, it actually looks like they're trying to be aggressive on C. No, we'll, we'll look at Sabba Sabba, because he is up here and uh, spotted out some stuff. And he definitely, yeah. <laughs> Not looking good, but Blue does has, have this Uber right now. A little bit of an advantage, but it's not going to be enough to do anything. So here they go, the pop is in, popped on the... Demo who gets in there. Jonas goes down immediately to a headshot, so we're not going to have that pyro to do some nice air blasting. Uh, we do have the soldier on the point that's Leku, but uh, here is the red for retaliation, and Leku goes down to a huge spun up minigun. Zub is going to get up on the spire and see if he can't make something work too, but he is going to run into the uh, opposing scout and I think the heavy as well. Uh, yeah, Zub goes down, so this is going to be a good defense right now for sandwiches and friends. They did lose Illy right there, and they lost their sniper, but it is going to mean they hold on for a little bit longer. And we already have 5 minutes and 11 seconds, which is, mm, I want to say, about average for Gravel Pit. Of course, it's, uh, hmm, I'm actually thinking of Six's times right now, and it's been a while since I've done the Highlander Gravel Pit. So, I don't know. I mean, I, I do know that somebody has capped all three points in Gravel Pit in less than three minutes because Sal casted that match and it was ridiculous. But, uh, so we'll, we'll say the five minutes long as I can Anyway, Napa putting down some spam and taking down the sentry gun. Oh, a nice kill, took it out. So Blue is in a good position right now to push. They won't have to deal with that sentry gun. Looks like they're going to come in from underneath, which is. Uh, interesting strategy, not too sure about it. Demo and Soldier are jumping up. Uh, we'll see if they can't get something going. Heavy is running up as well. The Uber is on the point with the um, uh, Pyro, sorry. Oh man, Mente and Beefy both going down there. Spun up Heavy right behind them. And that's going to be unsuccessful again. Uh, Ludku is still alive. Let's see if he can make magic happen, but he is all alone and yeah. He killed himself. He was just too lonely. It's it's hard being a soldier on a blue soldier in the midst of a red ocean of enemies. It's very tough. <laughs> I can only assume. Um, Mente went down pretty fast there, so not well. Supers are going to be about even. Is what I was going for there. Because how finishing up Funk. A nice sniper battle. We'll see if... Oh, he does finish off Prophet as well. So, a nice reflexes right there. Blue has got a nice little setup going right here. Do they have a teleporter? Uh, yes, they do. So, they will be able to repopulate the lines relatively fast. And so they're gearing up for their second push right now. We'll see what type of strategy they take this time. Not coming in from underneath. I don't think that helped them at all. It took way too much time for them to get to the spire. Oh, huge! 
sticky trap from Disco Disco taking out Mente and Jonas. That was the medic that he got taken out. Oh man. I don't know if that was I don't think that was blind dead. I think he was camping it out, but what a sticky trap. Love to see that. Latku finishing off Robert right there, but he takes down he gets taken down as well. Disco disco. Disco though. I'm sorry, don't wanna uh, cheat him out of a disco. He is three discos. He goes from disco times two. I don't know. But uh, here's Zub trying to get some action going with that bog. Cuba wants to finish up and says, "Yeah, you're not worth it," which is the worst thing you can say to a scout. <laughs> She's like, "You're not even worth my time." He's like, "What? No, I'm real. I'm a person." Saba Saba is ooh stabbing. I wonder if Saba Saba is like a different language for stabby stabby. I'm gonna say that it is because that is. I'm gonna say it's Portuguese for stabby stabby. There we go. Today you learned, guys. We see Red taking a very standard defensive positioning right here, keeping their medic safe. We have an Uber coming in on uh, the Pyro, interestingly enough. Uh, Red Pyro is popped uh, for the Uber in retaliation. Blue Pyro is just kind of like hanging out and trying not to take damage right here. They will um, oh, run into Zabba Zabba who gets Hoop and Bessie right there. Uh, so no Pyro and Heavy on the point, but Menti went down. There's really nobody alive for Blue to do anything. Nobody alive for Red either. Here comes Demo. Um, we're gonna have Demo on Demo action and uh, Disco 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 is setting up some of those nice sticky traps. So probably end of Blue's push right there if they know it's good for them. Because uh, right now they just be suiciding by this game. They are trying to push up a lot further though with this hold. Uh, look at this sentry gun. Um, getting very aggressive right there is Noretis. Uh, who is on the point? Hey, what you doing? Could have told me you're doing that. Oh, but come, coming in Disco Disco trying to stop it at the last second. But Jonas and Zoom getting that cap. Uh, kind of surprising there. <laughs> Sorry to get it, but nice little scout pyro cap action. Uh, good good teammates to bring to the fire because you have the speed with the scout and then the uh, pyro can just go ahead and air blast everyone out of the way. So not a bad idea and it did work and that gives a minute time of 9 minutes and 52 seconds which is a little on the long side. They probably took too much time on, uh, on C there. But definitely it is defendable. Especially when you're Noretis and you're getting Five suicides? That's 500 metal just right at your tips of your fingers and, and including that pack that's 540 and and then you do the math and you can build a since you're gonna I think you can build all three your oh man I don't like to math. There we go. Anyway that's 540 <laughs> and then of course you dispenser so you get lots of ammo. Anyway it's good. But you see this is the more standard position for the sentry gun. And it is more more, uh, more well protected here. So I think the center gun is a lot better than what Sandwiches and Friends had going on. Uh, but we'll see how it works out for Colony. We will see. We'll probably see them do the same thing, which is a uh, suicide a few players and try to get that medic pack. Medic pick. Indeed, we do see the demo and the soldier will follow their action as they get in here. Disco, 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 taking down Leku on the roof. That's going to be huge. And indeed, the center gun goes down immediately. Wow, some great action right there. And Sap is going down as well. Profit getting the saps down. Really, really impressive work right there from uh, Colony doing the work. I'm sorry, Sandwiches and Friends doing the work against Colony, and they're already panicked on the point. Um, time is being kept very, very slowly at A, so that may uh, encounter things a little bit. Oh my goodness! I missed Mente being backstabbed. Oh my goodness, and he had Uber right there, guys. Oh my goodness, that's huge. Sandwiches and friends are in such a good position right now. Uh, Devi has that 100% Uber. Red has nothing right now. Colony can't do a lot to stop this. They do have a spy, but Saba Saba going down. Bessie was taken down as well, but uh, better Bessie than the medic. Oh, but here comes uh, Letko, and he does force the pop. Oh, unfortunate right there for Sandwiches and Friends. But hey, Medic survived, so that is enough. At least Debbie is really hurt, and uh, we'll have to can't be too aggressive. Meanwhile, Connie is not ready to give up B, which is really, really interesting. Uh, Napper probably overextended right there, just trying to do it all himself, but dies. And that means there's not going to be any sticky traps, as some of these uh, blue players are going to push into the CB connector, I think. I think that's what they want to do. Look at them, they're just getting very, very aggressive. I do see a red sniper dot. What? How did... Okay. <laughs> hey guys, there's a sniper behind us. Uh, that's good to know. Anyway, so B is capped. Um, we have 7 minutes and 55 seconds left to cap C, looking very much in 
uh, sandwiches and friends a favor right now. There was somebody on the point. It looks like it was Wenzi, the soldier, getting up there, and he forced the uber pop. That's huge, huge, really nice work done by the soldier right there, because that means sandwiches and friends are going to be able to push in with a huge uber advantage um, as well. Noretus went down right there. That's oh, it's so sad. It makes my little engine heart weep. But uh, so no sentry defense for the time being. He is up now, though, so. Makes my um, little Inji heart smile, I guess. But uh, here comes a push now from Blue. Uh, flashed around to both the demo and Soldier getting up there, but there's a heavy on the point spun up. BQ finally does go down, uh, but there's a lot of blue players on the spire right now. Here comes Leku to try to stop him, but Airpipe takes him down. Wow, Soldiers and Friends doing nice, nice work. That was really impressive. A great coordinated push. Um, both on every point that coming out of the gate strong from just uh, taking down that sentry at B and then just continuing there. Um, yeah, so really impressive stuff right there. We will see how they uh, they respond in the second round. We will play another round uh, to see who wins it all. So don't go anywhere. Mission begins. Oops, I didn't even have to cut the recording. <laughs> Starting already. All right, so we will watch. Um, we'll watch Noretis. Looks like he had, um, his mini sentry out there for a second, so he's a little bit late on the get-go right here. We'll see if his team helps him out, though. Ludku does suicide. Oh, yep, yeah, there's blood and weapons everywhere. It's, mm, yum. So, Noretis, look at Zylish with his pink hat. Let's talk strategy now. So, Colony had a hard time defending B. Why was that? Because they lost their sentry gun and then they lost their medic. So really the important things right now are to defend roof. They have to get players up on the roof. Latku was up there before, uh, but he went down like almost immediately to, a, to some stickies. So uh, roof defense is really, really key in defending B. Looks like we do have a pause, so we're back. And we are hmm, supposed to be back after the pause. It started and now it's stopped. And there we go. All right, there we go. <laughs> so, yes, disco, 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 said it right. Longest on pause ever. Anyway, we should have 9 on 9. Um, HUD will be frozen and annoying for the next few minutes. I apologize about that. But what can you do? We're going to see a sentry jump. Yes, we are. Who's a good NG? No, Redis is a good NG doing a sentry jump. I'm getting that to spend a teleporter up there. That means a lot of people will be able to get onto the roof. Um, should probably upgrade it so we can get it going soon. We'll see, though, how this goes. Alright, we do have these first, um, suicides from Blue. It is Disco, 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 but, uh, he is finished off by Letku right there. We'll see, uh, did the Blue Soldier get in here? Yes, he was. I just missed him. Okay. So, Wendy goes down as well, um, Zub, it looks like, doing some work on A. So, this time, a pretty successful defense. Um, they kept their medic alive, they kept their sentry gun up, and there's a lot of people on the roof right now. Especially that heavy is going to be very key. So let's see what Sandwich and Friends can bring to the party. They hope to bring some pain to hurt. Um, very, very rude this party guest to bring that. But, <laughs> that was a really bad joke. Uh, so Hube is getting some heals from his medic. They're deciding which way they want to go. It looks like they were going to, are going to go from the C connector. Which is... Yes, checking for stickies as well. Okay, this is kind of boring. <laughs> we'll watch to look at the positioning Red has going on. Who is on the roof? We have the Heavy and the Soldier. We do not have the Dispenser down here though anymore. It is on the roof. Interesting. Interesting. And we have the Demo and Medic over here. Finally, we have this push from Blue Colony coming in from the side. We have that Reflecting Pyro right there. Watch your pills, guys. Do not... Uh... Oh wait, no, that was the other, that was the other. Anyway, still, spirers are good at reflecting things. Anyway, doing a good job keeping them in there with some nice stickies from uh, Napper, and then as well as some good defense from Jonas. And so far, nobody getting, somebody did get on the point for just a little bit of time, but uh, was not that significant. Centrica did go down, Disco 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 is doing some work right now, and the heavy classes are still pushing right now, even though there's no Uber. We'll see if, uh, yeah, a ton of spam going in there 
from Napper, and he does take down Disco and Huke, so big stickies right there. Well, they should not have been there when they were so uh, hurt, but uh, that's going to be huge for holding on to this defense for a little bit longer. So 45 seconds on point A, not bad, not bad indeed. But B is going to have to get done early. Here we have these heavier classes coming back. We'll watch the Disco times 3 can. See what he can to do. Funk taking down Kisakala. Meh. Soldiers take, or snipers taking down snipers. What else is new? But uh, let's watch this Disco checking for stickies. He knows all about those stickies, right? That uh, two kill detonation earlier. Uh, they've spotted everything out. Uber is popped. Sapper down on the gun. Engineer's having a hard time right there. Both Ubers going off right now. Uh, we'll see who survives longer. Red Uber is just used now for retreat. Meg has got to get out of there. Did he uh, escape? Yeah, Mente is out of there. There's a sentry gun going up. Noretis is trying to make anything happen right now, but it's not going to happen. Blue has successfully taken over B and the entire area. Noretis is going to escape. Do just fall back and build a C. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was a good thought, though. And um, right now, Red is going to try to do whatever they can to stop this, but a little bit overextended was the heavy right there. Beef Q getting taken down. Uh, Hup did get taken down right there, so it's not going to be as bad as I had feared for Napper because he was a little far up and really hurt. Uh, he should be backing up right now, just studying down some sticky traps. They just need to buy time for their engineer. Mente is at 80%, so we will have an Uber relatively soon in order to to counter the blue Uber that'll be coming in. Here comes the blue Uber. Will Mente get the, his Uber in time is the question. Yes, he will, and he pops it immediately. Not a bad idea. Oh, Debbie, as soon as his Uber wears off, he goes down. We do have some action on the point, though. Heavier classes, like the Heavy and the Soldier are up there. Oh, they both explode in a messy, messy explosion. Napper getting up hill to take down two. Um, really nice work there from Napper. Both of these uh, demo men are great. Love to see good demo uh, demo men and demo women, especially in a gravel pit when you can. There's a lot of opportunities for sticky traps, and then there's a lot of opportunities for sticky jumping, and uh, to see demo men take the most of that, use the most of that uh, advantage of the class is really fun to watch. Alright, so Mente has about 70% Uber, no doubt they will just sit on that and wait for Blue to come in. No reason to be aggressive right now, they're just camping and waiting to get the longest time that they possibly can because they're going to have to beat it next round as they are offense. So remember, Sandwiches and Friends are winning by one right now. Well, it is one nothing by right now. <laughs> by right now. Words. Words. Oh, the sentry gun is toast. Yep. Oh, poor sentry gun. Does that count as a headshot? I feel like it should. This, uh, this teleporter is toast. Oh, he's just camping it now. Take down the tether. There you go. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Knew that was coming. Uh, anyway, we'll, we'll go into some more interesting action. I'm not that seeing a sniper take down buildings isn't really interesting. Um, it, it's just not. Because we have Ubers who will be pushing soon and I uh, just go through windows. That's okay. Don't mind my camera work. It will never improve, apparently. Alright, so here we have uh, Wenzi and the Heavy coming in from underneath. They do not have their medic with them, but they do have these overheals. And in here, Bargy did as well. These are some suicides. What is going on with Sandwiches and Friends? Interesting strategy right here. Uber is popped. That's what they wanted. That is what they wanted. Uh, Uber is popped. Menta is really hurt. Nobody else alive for Blue right now because they uh, did their work. Oh man! Oh, Robin takes down Mente right there. He also took down Mahardis with a nice headshot on the Ambassador. So here is where the Blue Medic comes. Uh, he's got his heavy already with that respawn, and they have this Uber. Just need to hook up together, and they will make magic on this point. Hopefully they're thinking at least. It is the heavy and Medic. Oh, but here comes Pyro who's going to ruin everything. He does. Blows. Uh, oh, he extinguishers Debbie. And, oh god, it's not gonna end! Still, Sandwiches and Friends players are jumping up to the point, but we do have the, uh, Red Scout who is on fire, but he wants to keep this out. We do have a Wrangled Level 1 Sentry Gun. Um, will anybody be able to come up for Colony? Yes, we do have the Spy who takes down Wednesday, and, oh, Noretis finishes off Disco Disco and takes down Ilahe, but there we go, Prophet finishes off the cap. Wow, that was silly. <laughs> So 6 minutes and 56 seconds, a great time right there. Uh, definitely Colony has their work cut out for them. Let's see what Sandwiches and Friends puts together for a defense. Because that is what's going to matter. 
And then I was thinking, I was like, oh my god, he just died. Oh wait, yeah, it's, it's set up. But yeah, I love those stylish suicides. So much more fun than typing kill in the console. Regardless, uh, Illy Hey Hey is still going to have lots of metal to build up. Let's take a look and see if there's any interesting weapon choices or anything going on. We haven't really focused on what the NGs do on offense because it's not really interesting. I hate playing NG on offense on greenery. The, you, you can be aggressive, you can do some really interesting stuff, but it's generally sitting around building teleporters and then seeing them destroyed. Anyway, we're gonna watch the Napper Cam because he is undoubtedly going to go for a jump on the sentry again. We'll see if he's successful this time. Oh, he took a body shot! Not gonna happen today, or at least in the next few minutes, and Letko gets taken down as well, so nice stickies from Disco Disco. Disco? Uh, I think he was sticky trapped somewhere, maybe gonna belong dead, actually. But regardless, that is going to be good. Here comes Napper. He got some heals and he wants to go for this kill, but not going to make it. Illy and his gun takes him down immediately right there. Uh, so the roof defense, even though it's not stellar right now, we just have the one soldier up there. It is um, working out. We do scout up there right now, so we'll be able to um, hold it for a little bit longer, it looks like. Uh, Mente's got the 100% Reaper, still holding on to that. We'll see the push from them very shortly. Let us get on someone's camera who will be interesting. Hmm, who will be interesting? Beefki will probably be in the middle of this Uber as he is uh, the heavy on Highlander, which is usually in the middle of everything, and leading the team of the pack, if you will. Chicken for stickies. Oh, he has found some heavy classes, and there we go. Uber is popped. He's actually not going to be Uber right there. But we do have a little battle of the Uber Pyros in which nothing happens, but it's really funny to watch. Oh, Leku gets involved and gets taken down. Jonas gets taken down as well. So nice defense from Sandwiches and Friends and finish off whoever is left in there. I will be able to finish off that little Sentry Gun 2 and Noretis. Mente somehow, somehow escaped alive. That's impressive. I was not watching his cam, but maybe I should have because uh, he is alive and still holding on to 18%. Um, I don't know if you noticed, but the Vitasaw is still allowed, or was still allowed in Wireplay at this time, so both medics I think are running out. And I miss the Vitasaw. I miss it so much. I love the Vitasaw. Uh, but anyway. Anyway. Uh, ooh, ouch. So we have 4 minutes and 48 seconds left for Colony to cap both B and C, so definitely gonna it's getting a little tight right here. They need to pull out something. Mente doesn't have an Uber at the moment, but it may be time to start thinking of some different strategies where you don't push with this Uber. Maybe not yet, though, because it's not do or die time yet. Quite yet. And, uh, but Red does have a very solid defense going right here. We do have Ubers both at 100%. We're probably going to see something like we've seen last time, which is both uh, Ubers popped in this corner at the same time. Or Mente goes down to a headshot! Or that happens! Oh my goodness! Where was Mente that uh, Prophet got that headshot? Oh my goodness. Seriously bummed I missed that. But uh, props to Prophet. We'll just stay on this game for a second. Uh, see if we can't get another awesome one. Just get another one. So Uber dropped right there. And oh, not what Colony wanted. Not at all what they wanted or needed. And uh, that may, uh, that may do it. I don't know. It's gonna be really hard to push now um, without that Uber, and they're gonna have to wait a few more seconds for that Uber to get up. Meanwhile, Red is just sitting and waiting and eating sandwiches and being friends. Yep, that is pretty much what they're doing right now. Let's check out on blue to see uh, how they are going. Letku, interesting, has the direct hit going on. Which is not a bad idea, especially if you know where that sentry gun is, but it is a bad idea if you get involved in this little commander and you don't even know there's a soldier behind your doors. Um, that was me talking really fast. <laughs> Uber is pop. It looks like they're not even gonna go after Wednesday right now. Oh, and Beef Q taken down, Leku being taken down. Nobody like a colony. Oh my goodness, Jonas gets down too. So does Napper. Oh, Mente's got to get out of there. Will he? No, he didn't. Oh, Wednesday took him down right there, so, oh, not a good push from Blue right there. Let's see, the center gun did go down, but everything else is still up. I mean, you got the dispenser, what more do you need? 
Debbie is seriously in trouble. Oh, Zoom gets taken out right there. So we only have two minutes and 30 seconds left before two caps, which is going to be really tough. This is do or die time now. They can't really wait for an Uber right now. And they have to make these pushes without the luxury of an Uber, which is going to be really hard. Maybe they should go to crits? I don't know. It wouldn't be that terrible of an idea. That terrible... Of, that bad of an idea. I don't know. But, uh... We'll see though, because I've got two minutes left. I definitely shouldn't bring out the bottle. Definitely need to protect Mente, but he went down. Oh, now we're going down. Who else? Disco getting some great stickies in there. Uh, trying to defend right now. Covered in milk. I hope it's skimmed because skim milk would be gross. He covered it. Oh, no, I can't imagine skim milk would be any, any better. Um, but Blue is just continually pull, uh, pushing these people in. Right now we have BQ who is all alone and all dead. Not a good decision right there, and now we have the <laughs> pan. We have Disco Disco on the pan. Here comes Napper. He's gonna try and do something. He again is all alone trying to get the medic to pop. He does get that. Um, well, let's see what they can do with it. That will buy Mente a some advantage, uh, but will it be enough? Because 1 minute 20 seconds left. Time is really, really ticking down. This is do or die for Colony. I know, Echo, it's so exciting. You know, if you can kill my cat, that is what is happening. Somebody is on the point right now. Who is it? It is the Zoo, but he gets taken down to some crits from Illy. Napper trying his best to send in some stickies and defend against the scout. Not gonna happen. His medic is super hurt right now and so close to Uber. We'll see if Mente can get it. Mente can't get it. He's taken down by head job from who else but Prophet. Another great ambassador shot right there and that pretty much sealed the deal. Uh, that really, this defense really goes to some great picks from Profit. Um, oh, about 40 seconds left, but we'll stay on his cam to see what he can't pull out. Uh, definitely has some super steady aim with that ambassador. Very impressive. Uh, taken down Ionis right there, not a headshot, so not impressed, right? <laughs> um, oh, he exploded. Uranus, no, he did it. But, uh, some good stuff from Disco times three. Blue's making their final push. And oh, Prophet, there's a scout on you. Oh, Prophet. But that's okay. Sandwiches and Friends has an Uber left, and they will be able to just stand on the point and hold this as long as eight seconds can. And we have six, five, four, three, two. Nothing left for a Colony to do right there, and that is GG. A great game between Sandwiches and Friends and Colony, two European teams. They usually play two or three maps in wire play, so I do have another match between these guys. It's gonna be awesome. I can't wait. So stay tuned to Kip TV to watch a cast of that. In the meantime, thanks so much to Prophet who sent this in. I'm sorry I didn't get in your awesome headshots on camera, but uh, I talked about them, so that counts, right? And uh, if you want your match TV cast, definitely hit me up at falafel1066 at yahoo.com. Follow me on Twitter and Facebook and Twitch and whatever. Anyway, guys, thanks so much and have a good day.